and from Sardar Mahmoud Khan School, Anjumani Islam Pune. Dear students, we are uh, conducting the online classes for the SSLC students who are appearing this year 2020-20. Dear students, first of all, we have to analyze the chapter wise question and content. I have prepared from previous year the mass content and the blueprints of the board and analyze the chapter wise. The chapter wise marks. So, our today's topic is statistics. Statistics it is a very interesting chapter and it contains for your examination that is 6 months. It's very important and two questions is compulsory from this chapter. Dear students, how we get fully 6 marks from this chapter? So, how we can? So, it's, it is very easy. In this chapter, there is only four parts. What are they? That is me. Median, mode, and Oda. This student, we have that, sir, there are totally four topics in this chapter, only two questions. Yes, obviously, three questions, one question from this chapter, one question from among this topic. Whether it is mean, median, or mean. If it is in examination, mean median is asked, you have to choose anyone. Or median mode is asked, you have to choose anyone. Any one from these three topics, you can choose and answer. It means it is a compulsory question for your examination. And next come to the OJI. In that OJI, there is a two type of OJI that is less than OJI and more than OJI. Less than OJI and more than OJI. Now, we have to analyze so what is the mean of class mark, class interval, frequency. This class mark is the upper limit and lower limit of the class. So what is the mean of class? A number 20, 20, 20 to 30, 30 to 40, and so the number are representing this way. It is called the class. And this class is represented like this. And this one is a lower limit, lower class, lower limit of the class, and this one is an upper limit of the class. Upper limit of the class. Now, upper limit of the class. And the upper limit of the class. And similarly, similarly, what is the mean of frequency? A frequency. Is a number of observation. Number of observation. For example, in a class, students are there. There are totally 50 students are there. We are observing the student. How many girls and how many boys are there in the class? We have to observe that. And the number of boys is the observation of one part. Number of girls is the observation of another part. You have to take. That is the number of observation. That is called the number of observation is called the frequency. Number of observation is called the frequency, and the frequency is denoted by F i. The case is denoted by F i. And similarly, similar frequency is denoted by F i. F i. And similarly, similarly, there is another one. First class interval, frequency, and another one is a class mark. What is the class mark? Class mark is the midpoint of the class interval. What is that? Class mark is a midpoint of class interval. This one is the class interval. And this one is the frequency. Yes, and then class mark. Class mark is a midpoint of the class interval. What is the support? What is the mean of midpoint? Yes, so first of all, we have to divide the class with 10 to 20. 10 to 20 class mark. Yes, 10 to 20. This one is a class. 
what is the main point of this? We have to add. This is the formula, and plasma is always generated by xi. xi equals to upper limit plus of lower limit dy by k. What is the upper limit? Twenty plus ten. Divided by two. Twenty plus ten. It becomes thirty. Divided by two. And you can cancel two ones are two. And two ones are two again. You are carrying one and then two five again. Ten is zero. Plasma is fifty. We don't need this as x i equals to fifty. Dear student, now we are going to discuss the mean. What is the mean? Mean is a kind of average. We need to find the average of the student in the class or in the society. The number of boys in the class, the number of girls in the class, or number of community represented a particular community in the class, in the city. So we are we are going to discuss it now. What is the mean? Mean is a kind of average to find the average. Yes, what is the formula for mean? Yes, there are three types of mean. Uh, that is a direct method, other method, and step deviation. But it's most easy at example and most easy at chapter topic in this mean to find in the mean that is direct method. What is the formula for direct method mean? That is summation of f of i into x i divided by summation of Fi. So, what is represented by Fi? Fi is represented frequency and Xi is represented class I and summation of Fi is represented the sum, sum of number of observations in the given table. Now, we are going to discuss one top problem. Find the question number one. This question is asked in your examination. Example number one, find the mean of following table. The first one, the first one that is, we have following table. I that is class interval and the frequency. In the examination, there are the two tables are given. That is the first one class is that is 15 to 25, 25 to 35, 35 to 45, 45 to 55, and then 55 to 65. Now, frequency, what are the frequencies I have given? The 15 to 25, that is 6. Whenever the single number is coming, you have to use 0 and 6. And then 11, you use 0. And then 7, in the given question, that is 7. And uh, 5 and 6. And so, dear yes, students, the two tables are given in your examination. You need to solve to find the mean using this formula, and the mean is always denoted by x bar. It's denoted by x bar. So, we need to calculate how to find the mean. So, first, we need to find the mean. We need two column extra. That is, what is that? First of all, the x i and then second one column that is i into x i or now we need to find the x i x i is class 1 what is the class 1? the 
upper limit plus lower limit divided by 2. So what is the upper limit of this class? That is 25 plus 50. That becomes 40. 40 divided by 2, it becomes 20. This is the lower class. And then second, 25 plus 35, it becomes 60. And 60 divided by 2 again, it becomes 30. Obviously, we have to observe that is these two numbers are how many how much difference? 10 difference. So we continue, that is here next number is obviously 40 and then 15, 60. Is it easy? That's for this question for 3 marks question. 3 marks or 2 marks then in examination. Now only we need to find f i to x i. So what we have to do? We have to multiply this number into this number. 16 to 20. That becomes 120. 11 into 30. That becomes it is very easy simply. Simplification 11 into 3. 11 3 is a 33. Here 0 is a 33. This now. 7 for the 7 for the 20. Yes. 0 and then 5 5 is up 25 250 and then 6 6 is up 36 okay. 60 yes here we need to watch we need f of summation of f of x i and summation of f so we need to add the summation of f i that is summation of f i equals to 6 plus 1 7 7 plus 7 14 14 plus 5 14 plus 5, 19. 19 plus 6, 19 plus 6, it becomes 25. Then becomes 5 here and 2 can. 2 plus 1, it becomes 35. Is that clear? And then similarly in the next one, that is 0, add it is 0. 2 plus 3, 5. 5 plus 8, that becomes 30. 13 plus 5, 13 plus 5, 18. 18 plus 6, it becomes 18 plus 3 20, 24. 24 4, 4 carry 2. Now 1 plus 3, 4. 4 plus 2, 6. 6 plus 2. 6 plus 2, it becomes 8. 8 plus 3, 11. 11 plus 2, that is that is your summation of fi into xi. Now we write what we need to find it. Mean that is x bar is equals to. Summation of fi into xi divided by summation of fi. What is the value of here? What we have to have value? Summation of f of xi to fi into xi that is 13, 40 divided by summation of fi that is 35. We have to divide. Now we divide that is pi 7 is a 35, 5, 2 is a 10, and remaining here, how much? 3, and then again, 34 is remaining, now here, 7, 4 is a 7, 4 is a uh, sorry, sorry, 5, 5, 6 is a 30, and then remaining, that is 4, 5, 8, now it becomes 26, 26 8 divided by 7. Now we can calculate again. That is 7 the 7, 7, 3 is up. 7, 3 is up. We have, we have to calculate again here like this. It becomes 268 divided by 7. 7 on the 7, 7, 3 is up 21. And mean here for again. Remaining 5, 7, 8 is up. 7, 8 is up, 56. Here remaining 2. And 1 here is 0. 7, 2 is up, 14. And remaining 6. Again, point already taken. Here 0 we have to take. And then 7, 8 is up. Again, 7, 8 is up, 56. Again, 4. It becomes so many numbers. That's why that is the thickness. X bar is equal to 38.28. 
Thirty-eight point two eight. This that is your answer.